Alright you guys, got another video here for you on how to activate Windows 10 the right way. I've seen so many videos on YouTube showing people how to activate Windows 10 for free using a KMS activator or a script using command prompt. Do not use these methods. They are completely illegal and you're going to end up getting yourself infected. As you can see here, doing a simple search on Google also shows many, many websites that are promoting how to activate Windows 10 for free using this method. These methods will only ever last 30 days or 180 days and you will have to rerun the script. A lot of these will carry uh, malware inside them uh, like rats or backdoors, which will then obviously infect your system. The best way to do it is head over to CD Key Sales and sign up for an account with those guys there. It's free to join. You just go on there, put your email address, password, and your full name and then sign up once you've done that you can sign into your account if you've already got those details you can sign into your account right here by putting your email address in and password once you do this you can then just go to the search box here and type in here windows 10 pro and this will give you all the information for the offers they have running so let me just show you here now get a lot of questions asked about these license keys uh, OEM keys and retail. I've seen people saying they've tried the uh, keys and they can't transfer them. That's because this is an OEM key. If you want a retail key, this is the one here that you'll be able to reuse and unactivate and take it to another computer. These OEM keys are locked to one computer only. You can only use it once. And if you change out the motherboard or anything like that, basically your key will then be with that motherboard and you'll have to buy a new one. With a retail key, you can basically uh, unactivate it and take it to another computer and reuse it over and over. So these OEM keys are great for system builders. Just another thing I want to point out here, which is another qu common question I get, is can you upgrade from Windows 10 Home to Windows 10 Pro with these keys? No, you can't. It's not advisable. You're best off to reinstall Windows 10 Pro and then activate them. It says it clearly here in uh, in their text on this on the site there so just follow what it says before you purchase them it's no good moaning at me when you've bought the wrong key or you're trying to do the wrong thing another thing is to make sure the flags are on here make sure your country is listed here if it's not then it's not going to activate or you may have problems once you've got all this done you can then hit the buy now button and basically this will take you to the next page where you can use my discount code capital B, capital R, 09, this will give you a discount. Now, these discounts uh, range uh, from 25% to 30% and more sometimes, depending on the promotions that they're running at one, any one time. So as you can see here, I've added the promotion in, and you've got a reduction in price there, you can see, in US dollars. If you want to change it to your currency, you can choose your currency here, and you can see for... The U at Great British Pounds, it's eleven pounds and thirty-three pence. So once you're happy with that, you can then submit your order. I'm going to show you the whole process so you can see these keys work. Basically, hit the submit order, and this will take you to your PayPal window where you can choose PayPal. This is to protect you, and you can basically click on buy now. It will open up the PayPal window, and then you can put in your PayPal details. I'm going to put mine in and then log into my PayPal and pay for this. Let me go ahead and do that and we'll move on to the next stage and I'll show you exactly what to do next. Once you've done this, you'll be able to go over to the next page once we click login. And this will then pay for our a key that we've just purchased here. It says your order has been successfully uh, paid for. Right? So we've paid for this now. There is my order number. Just remember 783 at the end there i've blurred all the rest out but that is the number you just need to remember at the end if you go to the main window here where it says my purchased orders you can see my purchased order here it says it's completed and you can see that 783 is there 783 underscore one that means there's one item so it's 783 so you can view your code now when you click on this you will then be able to see get the key click on this get the key and it will then show your product key, which you can use to activate Windows 10 Pro. So let's go ahead and click on this so we can see it. There we go. I've blurred this out, of course, so you can't see it. But it, there it is listed there. 
and you can go back to this window at any time and get that key it will always be there so basically that is your key another thing they do is send you an email address as you can see here this is from uh, the site where you bought your key and it says your order you can click on your order there and if you've got any problems with activation or any other sort of problems or questions you want to ask them you can use the live chat there and click on this and try to get some help from them if you've got issues so let's go ahead and you can see i've got windows 10 pro here and it's not activated what i'm going to do here is click on uh, the button here where it says windows isn't activated activate windows now and then what will happen is you'll see some information here saying windows is not activated as you can see here and then all you need to do is come down to where it says change product key and we're going to click on this and this will open up another box and we can paste in that key that we've just purchased so just paste that key in there i'll blur it out here so i'm just going to paste it in and once you've got your key in here and you're happy with that you can click on the next button and this will then take you to the next stage so now all we need to do is click the activate button and this will then go off and connect to the microsoft activation servers and check our key to make sure it's legit and then activate our version of windows and you can see here it's gone through flawlessly no problem at all and activated our version of windows and you see me do that with my own account i've just created an account and basically gone there and bought a key and activated windows 10 i wanted to show you the whole process so you can see it working for yourself so just to quickly recap if you've got windows 10 home and you want to upgrade to windows 10 pro you will need to do a fresh install and use that key and it should work flawlessly like you see there two if you want an oem key that is locked to the pc that you're using you can't transfer that key over to another computer that key will only work on one computer the retail keys that you buy if you buy a retail key you can unactivate it and take it to your new computer and use it on there if you wish you can only use it on one computer at any one time stay clear of those free kms activation uh, scripts and sites because they are laced with malware and backdoors and rats and you're going to end up with major problems on your system don't download any executables for activation or anything like that you're going to end up getting infected and putting root kits on the system and you're going to end up with major problems doing it this way is a cheap and affordable way and it's pretty much uh, going to give you a activated copy of windows 10 pro anyway but that said my name has been brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk big shout out to all my youtube members who join my youtube members group i appreciate the support and i shall see you again for another video real soon bye for now Thank you.